Hello, it is Jermaine Blackwell for Broadway Unlocked outside of the New York City Stock Exchange, where once again Broadway Unlocked has cut the fat. We are in front of the New York City Stock Exchange where we first met Business Pig. Jermaine, did you know someone tweeted us during the concert and asked if we remembered to bring Business Pig? Business Pig was there and he brought us great luck with his pig's feet. That's right. Business Pig is now officially in charge of everything because he knocked it out of the park for the concert. Oink. Jermaine, it's uh, we're actually filming this on Wednesday, which is two days after the concert. I am still exhausted. You can I look I feel like I look exhausted. I'm not sure I've actually slept enough yet. <laughs> yeah, I'm a little bit tired. It's my first day back at my survival job, and I am not feeling it. It's also a torrential downpour here in front of the New York City Stock Exchange, where Business Pig is getting all wet. <laughs> we need to get like um. You know how like uh, Jimmy, uh, like there's Flat Stanley or whatever? We need to actually make a business pig that we can take with us when we do things. I think that whenever we do the Give Back concert from now on, we should try to get like one of the guys, like maybe Kyle Dean Massey to put on a pig mascot costume. And then it's... Y'all ready for this? <laughs> no one will ever do our concert again if we... <laughs> <laughs> to do that oh man well the concert was amazing we have all kinds of stuff to tell you guys about so uh let's get to it okay okay like at the concert let's do our top five things that happened at the give back concert one of my favorite things that happened at the concert was the periscope that was happening during the red carpet at intermission and the after party. Sean Doherty and Kaylee Greenwood took over our periscope account. They were freaking hilarious. And now Joey's doing some pretty amazing sound check business, so let's go check it out. It was great to see like people following us on their mobile phones, like because that's the whole point of the concert, right? Is to bring it to everyone. Yeah, and there were people like all around the world watching on Periscope and working with each other to um, make sure that we got a bunch of hearts so that we our Periscope feed would get popped up higher and, and they were encouraging each other to go donate. So I think that was incredible. It was definitely one of my favorite moments of the night. Mad Libs with Joey Contreras and Christina Alabado. It was so funny. Oh my gosh. It was last year was super funny because Joey did Mad Libs last year and it was such a hit. We were like, let's do this again this year. It's really fun. But this year was hilarious. And Christina not being able to keep it together <laughs> during it was amazing. A body part in Kansas City. Oh, glute Dias Maximus. I'm, I'm gonna put it to glutes. I'm gonna I gotta write this too, and she's gotta be able to read it. So. <laughs> Show me what is inside. All my children are for you. <laughs> so, because a lot of times, like people are re are really good at keeping it together, and then you're just like, it's like the SNL moment where like um, Jimmy Fallon like starts cracking up at the joke, and that's what makes us laugh. And she was giving us a lot of that, which was, I appreciated. Totally, and my other favorite thing about the, the song was it was so appropriate that the whole thing ended with, I forget the lyric and ready, but like something about give me your, and it was barbecue sandwiches, which is awesome because Kansas City, where our Google Fiber Watch Party was, is known for barbecue, of course. So of course it would end the song. It was indeed a Casey masterpiece. <laughs> The performances, in particular, my very favorite performance of the night at the Give Back concert was Carolee Carmelo. Oh, sorry. I just had a Carolee Carmelo gasm. I love Carolee Carmelo. I have loved her for a long time. I sort of couldn't believe that I was meeting her. And she sang a song that was really special to us because it was actually written by Nathan Tyson and uh, our friend Nikkei Anchor Bloom based on the writings of a survivor from CBTC. 
Um, and so it was special to begin with, but like halfway through when she was like, went from like pretty thoughtful Carolee Carmelo to like unhinged jaw giant belt note Carolee Carmelo. I was like crying and also wetting my pants and a few other things. It was just ridiculous. <laughs> yeah, it was pretty amazing. And like, she's just one of those people that like, she started like very softly, as you said. And then all of a sudden, she just opened her mouth and all the feels came out of her mouth and into my eyes and just tears. <laughs> the digital stuff. And maybe I'm congratulating myself because I edited it, edited it edited most of them, pat on the back. They were really good. I actually was telling someone yesterday that we shot all that stuff on iPhones with mobile rigs, and that we used apps to do all the VFX, and the person just about fell over on the ground. They like, didn't believe me. Joey Contreras, Christina Alabato, Spencer Kiley, and Taylor Louderman. Shelby Floyd and the EGADS Theater Company. Yeah, it's pretty cool to be able to go like on iTunes, or the App Store, App Store rather, and like find little things that you can use and manipulate because I don't know how to use After Effects. I'm, you know, kind of manipulating things the way I need them to be. And um, using little apps to figure stuff out is pretty cool. Oh my gosh, Jess and Jermaine. That's what we did. That's exactly what we did. We used iPhones and rigs too. Yeah. Carl, Carl, Kyle, how did you get on this Hangout? Jess, part of Broadway Unlocked, you know, like the new video series that we're doing. Yeah. That's what asked us to do. Remember we were there at the concert, we interviewed Kyle Dean, Lilla Crawford, yeah. all kinds of people. It was so much fun. Who the hell are these guys? Here's the thing. Um, they apparently have a show they're filming for YouTube, uh, and they are uh, under the impression that I have hired them to, to, to make it for Broadway Unlocked, which I uh, have not. Jess, Jess, come on. You did hire us to do Living the Dream with Kyle and Carl. It's going to be the best reporting YouTube series about Broadway that there has ever been. Broadway needs us. Okay, all right. You know what? Fine. Just can you show me, like, a little bit of it? Let's just, let's just see a little bit of what you've done. Do you have any advice for me to play Annie? Um, well, um, you definitely need the red hair. Doable. You need to try on some wigs. Ready. Uh, that definitely, as soon as you put that on, then it's like... You're singing with dogs. What is the most dense object that you've ever been able to cut with your jaw? <laughs> like diamonds? I've gone in for kisses and have just murdered people before. Wow, I, I've i never thought of the practical use for it. That is, that's a scary thing. Yeah, it is, you know. Bloody boyfriends everywhere. It's too bad. So I remade the Kylie Jenner um, interview magazine shoot. Uh, so you're basically like a Kardashian now. <laughs> No. <laughs> no. I don't wish that for anyone. No, thank you. That was kind of funny. You should totally let them make a show for us. Oh, my God. Fine. 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 Yeah! <laughs> that means all of you check out YouTube on Friday. Living the Dream with Kyle and Carl is coming your way. You guys, please watch this so I don't regret this decision. I think we're going to have to call it a tie, and I want to say that part one of the tie is the KC New York performance when um, Shelby Floyd and the EGATS Theater Company sang with Dee Rossioli um, and the cast of the Give Back concert. I'm growing up again. That was the first time, as far as I know, that Broadway has performed live with people in other cities and other states, and it was totally mind-blowing, all made possible because of Google Fiber's high-speed internet. It made our live stream really fast and almost like we were all together in the same room. It was insane. It was awesome. And such an appropriate song to sing kind of on a global level, um, Kate Kerrigan and Brian Laudermilk's Holding On, which has become the theme of the Give Back concert and um, particularly with the CBTC and Moxa, so appropriate and beautiful for the evening. And the other tie for number one, of course, is how much we raised. Thanks to you guys and everybody who donated on that Indiegogo campaign through the One Today app on Monday during our live funding challenge. Everyone who um, bid on a silent auction um, item and won it 
all of you guys all together, plus all the performers and writers that performed at the Give Back concert, helped us raise $50,233 and 67 cents. And it's all because of you guys. So thank you so much for donating. Thank you so much for spreading the word like you did. And um, we can't wait to do it again. Oh, man, Jermaine, that's our last campaign update, number 19. Oh, man, really? I know. I was thinking. I had a really good time filming this vlog. How about you? Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, fine. I don't really care if you had a good time or not. I still have a good idea. What's your idea? Well, my idea is maybe we should keep vlogging. Ooh. I love Jermaine's surprised face. Um, yeah, I think we should keep vlogging once a week, have our own vlog show. Um, it won't be about the campaign, uh, of course, until we get back to next year and the Give Back concert, but we'll do other internet theater related things. And I think that'll be really fun. So like maybe Monday mornings it'll come out. I think that sounds good. Great. So let's do a vlog. Monday mornings, it'll come out on our YouTube channel. Um, we need a name for it. We're definitely going to do like top five internet uh, theatery moments and kind of do all that fun Broadway Unlocked stuff. So if you have a good idea, leave it in the comments. I mean, like things that are catchy, like I don't know, like Mamma Mia, Hamilton, things like that. Yeah. Everything that everybody's already taken as a name, just let us know which one you like best and we'll steal it. This is the Ham for Ham blog, guys. And don't forget, tune in tomorrow for the premiere of Broadway Unlocks, the very first piece of original content, Living the Dream with Carl and Kyle. It's going to be amazing. They shot at the concert. It's hilarious. And you definitely got to watch. So stick with us and come back and check us out on Mondays. Yeah, yeah, Mondays. And we will be putting up video from the concert soon as well. So hit that subscribe button. Bye. Bye.